Hey you guys, my name is Caricia. Welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new here. Today I'm going to be doing an Ipsy Glam Bag unboxing, my very last one. So if you want to see what I got in this Ipsy Glam Bag and why it's going to be my last unboxing, then be sure to give this video a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button down below and the bell button to be notified for future videos and leave me a comment on what item was your favorite in this entire unboxing or what you think you tried and let's just get into this video. So this is it guys. I actually did no what was gonna be in this one i know there's an oil but i don't remember what else there is because i think each month with the glam bag you get an email telling you what you're gonna get in the glam bag but up until this very last one i've never looked at the email because i just like to be surprised like little gift to myself you know sort of basically yeah pretty much i think this is october it's actually november now but like who cares i haven't opened it till now and that's part of the reason why this is gonna be my last bag but i'll basically get into that at the end of this video so i'm just gonna show you what i got this is the bag of the month i guess i love these bags so much these are one of my favorite things with the ipsy glam bag um subscription were these little bags but so let's see what i got first so the first item is from mac this is their lip gloss brilliant uh leaves it's in French. I don't know. Has anyone ever tried this? I feel like I've heard of MAC lip gloss, but I don't know. I know I've heard of their lip gloss, so I don't know if it's the same thing. I'm excited to try this because I heard that their lip glosses are really, really good. This is in the color Love Child, and it's just like this mauve kind of pink. I literally would have tried this with this look if I had opened it before because this is a very pretty color and it has like gold flecks in it. If you guys want to see this look, I recently posted it on my channel. So if you want to get this look, be sure to check out my channel and watch that video. It wasn't really hard and it was also a drugstore. So. so next is a brush. Okay, I love when they give brushes actually because you can never have too many brushes. And honestly, I felt like I needed more brushes anyway. It's just a sparkly purple one and I love when they're like cute. My favorite brushes are my Cala brushes and they're like pink and they're just so pretty and it's really soft and it has like two little rhinestones here it's so cute so next we have this Agar Sood face oil or yeah Sood face oil I don't know why they say that like why don't why don't you just put soothing face oil then I can read it like a actual human being like or it's just a soothing whatever you know so this is what I saw in the email it's just this really tiny thing i actually thought from the email that it was going to be a lot bigger than this but um i'm not complaining it says ho 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 poabab i don't know how to read that guys but um i'll put it on the screen poabab or poabab oil is high in alex oh oh my god that's some big words i ain't never seen in my life in this <laughs> um yeah this is poabab oil whatever high in olesic oleic oleic acid antioxidant and vitamins a d and e for highly effective moisturization jojoba oil is balancing and rapid absorbing together they work in tandem to soothe and heal ritual place two to four drops into palm press palm together to warm oil and inhale deeply rub and gently press onto face applying oil onto hydrated skin will aid absorption for optimal results miss with agar toner prior to use um, i'm obviously not going to get optimal results because i'm buying nothing so next up is this wander beauty it says lift off purifying and brightening peel off mask i love face masks especially ones that are like pre-made because i have like my aztec healing clay mask and as much as i love my aztec healing clay mask i hate having to mix it before and i feel like that like puts me off from using it i'm actually breaking out right now guys i need to do a face mask but i also think i'm breaking out because i haven't been drinking a lot of water i was like why am i breaking out and then i, like, I realized I'm like when was the last time i actually drink some freaking water so that's probably the reason why drink water guys drink water don't not drink water guys that's the worst thing you could do if you have really bad skin water is probably your main issue so this is wander beauty lift off purifying and brightening peel off mask this bright berry pearl peel off mask contains a skin loving blend of ake goji berry 
blueberry lychee mango steam and green tea extract to heal purify and replenish dull skin niacinamide <laughs> on the screen because I'm not gonna read that one <laughs> ever helps reduce the appearance of wrinkles and hyperpigmentation for more vibrant looking skin it says smooth and even layer all over your face avoiding the eye wait 10 to 15 minutes or until mask is completely dry and slowly peel off from the edges I'm gonna try this out actually since my face is breaking out and I know I'm gonna do a mask I'm gonna just try it out and I also really like the color I hope the mask is this color too because I don't no, I like using oh it has like a seal on it as it should I hope it's the same color as the packaging because it's really like this pretty lilac color and it says pearl and it this color is kind of pearly yeah I don't know I like pretty face mask and lastly this is IBY it says lush eyeshadow midnight sky IBY beauty inspired by you IBY that makes sense okay right <laughs> I wouldn't got that <laughs> they didn't explain it Aw, uh, it comes in this little, like, compact. It really looks like a face powder compact. So cute. And it's just this, like, really dark blue. Oh, this is so pretty. Alright, I'm gonna swatch it for you guys. I think I took too much, but it's okay. I'm just gonna swatch it. That's so pretty. That pigmentation, though. This is the second eyeshadow I've had in one of these glam bag things. It's like a navy blue. I don't have any colors like this, so I'm pretty excited to, like, see what I could do where I could go with this color um is there any other details it says IBY lush eyeshadows are highly pigmented as we can see buttery and blendable shades infused with rose hip seed oil for skin protecting properties Ooh, so it's pretty and good for your skin that's bomb especially your eyelids I feel like your eyelids probably don't get any special care so I feel like that's pretty bomb. So yeah, I guess lastly, I'll tell you guys why this is my last Ipsy Glam Bag unboxing. Well, first of all, as you can see, I don't usually open these bags. Like literally, I feel like I don't use the products. I feel like I don't use most of the products. Like I'll use the brushes. I'll use the brushes <laughs> no i'll use the brushes and um the brushes and the face mask but that's basically it and i feel like for ten dollars i'm really not getting things that i'm gonna use really or that i'm using enough but they do have this option where you can purchase ipsy glam bags like have them come on months where you want them like you could pick and choose what months you want them but honestly i feel like i stacked up so many products already from the months that i already had that i just don't need anymore for right now like i might rejoin the subscription and maybe i'll continue this but i also might not i can't even sorry guys i got some like youtube notifications yeah i just feel like i'm not using them enough and that's really it i feel like i'm wasting my money each month literally you can choose when you want these to come and i think that's great for other people or if i had known that earlier sorry if you could see my closure guys i know that looks crazy but honestly i feel like the just the thought of like having little little gifts to me every month from myself was like a good idea at first but knowing how wasteful i'm being with my own money it's just like uh i could just not do that right now and get some full size products that i actually like and actually will use up so like maybe in the future i'll rejoin fc but as for right now this is gonna be my last unboxing from this company i hope i explained that well enough but yeah thank you guys so much for watching this video i'll still be happy to see you in my next video whatever that is going to be the only way you know is if you subscribe down below and hit that bell button to be notified be sure to give me a thumbs up and leave me a comment down below what your favorite item was and i'll see you in my next video like i said guys thank you so much for watching and bye